Yeah, well, man, that's a man. Yeah, man, man. Yeah, well, man, man. Yeah, 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 I feel positive, like I feel like the boys are buying into the system that Maz Hearty and the Gaffer are doing, and we're working towards perfecting it really. Mm. And you seem to have a thing about playing Brighton as well. That's two goals in as many games against them. Yeah, man, I like the seaside. <laughs> I like the seaside, trust me. Um, it looked quite a tough physical game from the sidelines as well. Uh, what was it like in, in midfield? It was like their they're, they're four and eight were really at it, but you know what? 
up in gym and I've been going hard in the gym and I showed them a bit of strength. <laughs> we can see that. Um, I suppose on to folks the next week as well. How do you rate our chances going into that? Every game we've got a good chance, but that's going to probably be a bit of a harder game than today. So I think we've got, just got to apply ourselves on Tuesday and Thursday and just train with the intensity that we trained last week and bring the same intensity and if, if anything, even more on Saturday to overcome them. Mm. And I suppose it's early doors, but whisper it, we're top of the league. I must feel good. Can I swear? I can't, innit? <laughs> I'm on top of the league. PK, cheers for joining us. All Thank you. Yeah, Pleasure. of course. It was tough. We had a difficult pre season, but like I said, nothing's given out in pre season. We sit top of the league, two games gone. It's really early days, but that was a good performance, and I thought our attitude towards the performance, because Brighton City had a good shape about them, caused us problems in wide areas. We managed to nullify their, their threats and strengths, and, and we had a few chances. It could have been a few more, apart from their keeper made a few good saves. How busy was that second? Response, especially sort of given how scrappy the first half was at times. Um, it must have been quite pleasing that we actually took the game to them. Yeah, we spoke about that at half term though. We can't just sit back on 1-0. 1-0 is such a tough scoreline because they get their goal, then they're in the ascendancy and then you're always liable to, to concede another. So yeah, we spoke about being on the front foot, pressing them early, um, winning the ball in their half and then when we get on the ball actually having a little bit more quality in the final third and we created three or four really good chances but unfortunately, like I said, uh, we couldn't take them. Mm. As you say, sort of set pieces haven't exactly been a strength so far this season but we look quite solid today. Yeah, we've worked really hard. Uh, the work Harty, the gaffer and myself have done over the training pitch over the last two weeks has, has been about our defensive shape and set pieces because they're such a large part of the game. And I think last week at Carl Shorten we defended 15 set pieces so uh, that's that's a big part of it so we have to get that right. Mm. Personally, sort of from a personal standpoint, what was it like taking charge of the boys today? Yeah, it was nice. Look, it's, personally, it was probably the same. Uh, we're a group. Uh, obviously the gaffer's at the helm of it, but uh, Harty, myself, Neil, John, everyone, the players, the subs, whoever it is, we're a group. So. No, no single one person takes a plaudit, so I just had to step in as unfortunately Andy couldn't be here due, due to work uh, issues. Um, but yeah, we got the win, that was the main thing, so I was pleased about that. 